Hello and welcome back to Boring Dad Gaming, where today we're going to be playing some more Coral Island. Uh, first things first, I think I've probably got some skill points to spend, I just keep forgetting to do it. Uh, well, one. That's not too bad though, is it? Uh, chance for watered soil to stay water the following day, one in four chance. That's not too bad. Although I do want to eventually get to everything being uh, having sprinklers on it. Uh, chance to harvest, 10% chance for better quality, that could be worth it. Or chance to have five percent chance to harvest double crops. I think we'll go for the ten percent chance to harvest uh, better quality. Yeah, it's not a huge chance, but every little helps, doesn't it? I'll take the scrap. Take this essence. Oh, quest complete. What have we done? What have we done? Essence extraction. Claim reward. What do we get? What do I get? Uh, don't know. Couldn't tell me. Maybe it will become apparent. Um, okay, I don't think there's anything to harvest today. Well, my dad in with another tip. It said if you right click on the crops, low. I'll do it currently. Ah. He said that I can tell what's planted and how long it will take. I can't see it. Never mind. He'll probably watch this video and then tell me exactly what I'm doing wrong. He's he's got quite a lot of time in Coral Island, so he's he's been he's been sending me tips over WhatsApp. Most of which I'll probably forget. <laughs> the tips are good. These ones, these spiky ones, I'm pretty sure are carrots. And we've got some sugar cane up there. Not sure what these lower ones are. There we go, watering done. Um, so what What else do I want to do? I would like to do, I think I would like to do my sickle, uh, or scythe, I'm gonna call it a sickle, it is a sickle. Um, up to, up to bronze. Need money for that though, so I'm a bit light on that front. I might as well keep the bronze in my chest for now, to be honest, actually. Um, but we do want to make the kelp Essence extractor, whatever that is. No, I've made that. I've made that, haven't I? Um, oh, in that case, yeah, I'm saved. So I'm saving this bronze essence. I need, I think, two thousand coins to be able to upgrade, like my seed level and stuff. So that'll be a while off. Uh, we'll pop, the, pop the scrap in here as well. Go get some more scrap going. I have got a lot of trash, so let's maybe we'll fill our recycler up again. Scrap is pretty useful, and that can just whir away now for the rest of the day. So, um, so the question becomes, what do we do? Um, well, I've got. Hmm. Let's see. Well, our choices are we could go to the ocean and do a bit of clearance there. We could go to the mine and maybe try and get down another five levels. I'm tempted to do that. I'd like to get down to the next level of ores to find. Uh, I think that'd be good. Uh, we could catch bugs and stuff or go fishing. Or maybe we'll... I think I might do mine. Although, I wonder if I can create any food that will help me keep me going there. So we could make three of those. That'll be a bit of stamina. And what about the... We can make... Oh, that's a trap. What's, which is the snack? This is the snack. So if we use that... I don't know how much that gives us. It's actually not too bad. Yeah, I think that'll that'll help sustain us in the mine for a little while, although I should probably take my sword. Or my hammer, right? I haven't used the hammer in combat yet. I'll keep the fishing rod just in case I want to do any fishing on the way or, or not on the way back. We're going all in on the hammer, not even taking the sword as a backup. Oh, bug. Um, I want to kind of get ahead of it in the direction it's moving. A Sam silk moth. I'm pretty sure that we've uh, given that to the museum. 
Uh, oh, uh, yeah, maybe I'll, what I might do is um, check out how much it's going to cost to get some animal stuff going on the farm. So we get chickens for 600. That's not too bad. Horses, a lot of money. And what else can we buy? Oh, I see. Okay. I wonder how much the... A chicken coop will cost. Where are the waku carpenter? Oh, there, yeah, they open at nine. So what I might do? Well, I'm running over there. I'll just put the uh, game speed up a little bit. So hopefully they'll have opened by the time I get there. So let's do the sickle. That's going to be. Uh, 1500 isn't it? I think when we get our next crop of stuff going, that, it shouldn't be too hard to hit that. And then it's just a question of how much more it will take to get a, a chicken coop going. And what resources it will require as well. I mean, I'm hoping I've, I've mostly got those, but you never know. Uh, where's their shop? Is this the shop? Uh, carpenter. Coop, 2,000. That's not too bad. So what do we need? Wood, fine. Stone, fine. Bronze bar, fine. But I would need to get another 25 bronze ore in. And fibre, fine. Okay. What else can we do? Water source. Mill for processing grain. Silo. Fish pond. Put any fish to multiply over time. It's expensive, but that sounds kind of nice. Gold kelp essence. Oh yeah, that'll be a while. Gold bar. Hardwood. So these look sound pretty cool, but they, they sort of require resources I don't have access to as yet. But the coop is definitely something we could do. The barn, a bit more expensive, but again, you know, definitely something we could add at some point soon. Same for the well, the mill, the silo, I don't know how to do resin. I don't know if they sell it here. I was going to say I wouldn't mind buying a calendar, but actually, you know, it's, it's more money than, <laughs> than I currently have. But okay, we've got an idea now of, of, of what we're aiming for. Oh, hello. Oh no, she's just trying to come in her house. I thought it was a cutscene. All right, let's take this down again. There we go. So, let's go to the mine. Yeah. Oh, there's some wasabi there. Oh, that looks like a chest as well. Hang on. What have we got here? I've got some candy tree seeds. Very nice. That is actually very useful for me right now. I assume it's been there all this time and I've just not noticed. Oh, 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 oh. Hang on. I'd like, to, I'd like to get that praying mantis if I can, but I'm going to have to try and ambush it, I think. Yeah, that's definitely one for the uh, museum. Oh, I filled, filled up a little bit. But that's okay. We don't get that much stuff in the mines. Another wasabi. Grab that. I said, can I just eat these? I, I can. So if I get low on energy again, we can, we can munch on that. Have a little look up here. Because I wasn't quite sure what... Oh, there's another praying mantis. Maybe I could try and grab that too. Ah, I can't go any further. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Gotcha. Oh, I can go. Oh, I don't know why it felt like I was blocked from going any further down this way. It looks like there is stuff to do there, but currently uh, blocked off. Yeah, I've no idea what opened up last night. If you remember, there was a little cutscene with some glowy trees and stuff. Oh, hello. Wait, did you have human? Thank you. It's that much I did after ceremony. Go see goddess. I hope you have. I have. Goom goom. Talk now, we will. Night of full moon many, many seasons ago. Giants I did find frozen here in cavern. Alive they are, but unable I am to free them. They don't look very giant. 
powerful magic cast. Earth, water, wind, all here, but fire, not here. Suspicious this is. Investigate. I want further in each chart, but strong barrier prevent me. Cannot enter. But you freely enter Earthshaft, I have seen. Clues of why giants frozen must be inside. If go into shafts again, help me, will you, to investigate? If find anything, I can sense and will come here. Okay. I guess perhaps we're getting close to a level where we might find something like that then. Why are they called giants? They're very small. Uh, 20. So I don't know, I've, I've no idea how far down each of these shafts go. Uh, we've obviously not reached the uh, floor of this one yet. Have a quick check over here. I don't expect to find anything, but you never know. Oh, we've got some more. Very nice. We'll take that room. We're looking for about 25. Turn my speaker down a bit. Oh, we found the exit already. That's pretty cool. So we'll just have a little look around and see what else we've got here. We've got a little monster. Oh, he's new. Let's go and test our hammer on him. Oh. He hit me. My hammer is quite slow. Does a lot of damage, but I think enemies will get in hits. Oh, hello. You're new too. I have to... Uh... Damn. Usually in games like this, I prefer to have like a, a weapon that maybe does less damage, but um, swings a lot faster. So hopefully we'll find, I mean, there's some. I know there are other weapons to buy. They were quite expensive though. Um, but hopefully we find like a better sword than the one we had. Oh, there's another one of those guys. Wow, I crit for 250-odd damage there. I haven't seen our... I mean, I may have missed it, but I haven't seen our double um, or feet proc yet today. I think it's a 20% chance, isn't it? So we've been a little unlucky. I guess I could have moved out of the way of that, but... I know that I'll be probably be using a stamina boost at some point. What's this? Sap. And they and they'll heal me too, so. Okay, we'll just start looking for the exit, I suppose. lucky on the previous floor, so I guess that makes up for it. Well, here it is, so I guess we jump in. And okay, we've got more sleepy monsters. Nope. Still no double or proc. Without a dodge key, it's hard to know to kind of how to avoid those monster hits. I mean, I guess you hit and then 
just jump back a little bit, maybe? Um, I might eat this now. Ball of goop, yum yum. Now we just look for the exit, I suppose. There's no more ore here. Few monsters here, no ore there. Some ore here. It's a nice crit. So let's try this. So if I get in a like a whack like that. Oh wow, that was a one-hit kill. Uh, but what about like this? And then we'll back off. And then we'll hit again and back off. Okay. And then a big crit. There we go. Some double ore on that one. Nice. Down here. There's another monster up there. Got down here. Oh, that's where I came in. Okay, well, I guess we'll start looking for the exit. Uh, I've got some monsters down here. Oop. There we go. Avoiding damage a bit better now. Damn. They hit quick. I was expecting to get in a couple of hits that time before they hit back, but no. So we got some we've got some bronze ore here, so we'll we'll do that. I hope I haven't seen how much we've collected, but I'm hoping that'll be enough for everything we need to do. I can see another little monster there under the ground. That's a bug, but he um, doesn't seem to be targetable. Oh well. Okay, well I think that's pretty much it for this floor. I think we'll probably leave... Well, let's check how much ore we got. 34, that's enough. So I think we'll leave now. Uh, we got some stuff to sell. Oh, there's another bug there. I think it's a wasp. Which I'm pretty sure we've donated already. Get a bit more energy in. Okay, I think we... Oh, missed another mantis. I think we definitely go to the museum. Oh. I don't know if I've caught this one. Oh, be quick, be quick, be quick. Gotcha. Possibly have donated that one, but it's worth checking, I think. What we do with the rest of the day, I'm not sure. We could try and catch some fish, maybe. There are fish bundles at the uh, temple. I didn't really check them out to see actually what they involve. Oh, got another catty piddler. 
right, inventory full. So what can I dump? Uh, a bit of sap. Yeah, we definitely got the Red Admiral already. Okay, oh, inventory full, I suppose. Uh, probably not a great... Just I remember the canola was worth a little bit of money. I wasn't sure about the violet. Oh, recycling centre. Which I can't use for some reason. I'm not quite sure why. But we've got our recycler now on the farm, so it's, uh, it's a moot point, really. Uh, yeah, okay, just the praying mantis, then. It'd be nice to see some more of these guys. Like, I can see a couple of caterpillars and a couple of flies, but I've put quite a few butterflies in there now. Maybe we'll have to wait until we, uh... Get a bigger museum. I've got stuff to sell then. <clears throat> Pardon me. Uh, so maybe I'll go do that. I think it might be quicker to go to the... Oh, hello. Oh, no. I was trying to get in a good position to head them off, but they saw me. Oh, and that fly. Not doing very well. I just think it might be quicker to go to the diving site and teleport than run all the way back to the farm, but there is another... Oh, there's another couple of doodads here. Now, we've definitely got you. I think we've got, I think this is the same as the last one I caught, but, you know, we're looking to raise money, aren't we? So, now ah, it's running away from me. I have to... No, 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 oh, bollocks. I thought I, uh, did I not already? There we go, that's what I thought. five wood. We're not playing golf today anyway. Ho ho. Uh, okay, where am I going? I was trying to find the diving site, but oh yeah, okay. Probably would have been easy just to run home. Uh, oh, this, this is it. This is what I want. Probably save myself zero time. Oh yeah, I was going to say, has that only done one, but it's actually done 19. Um, so sell you, sell you, sell you, sell you, sell you, sell you. Now probably something you can do that I haven't been doing, again, a tip from my dad, is to quick transfer. So all the stuff I've already got stacked in the chest, if I press Z, automatically go up there. Just save a few clicks, which is nice. Likewise with that. Um, but we will... Recover the tools as well. Uh, what was my oh yeah watering can? Okay. Decent amount of that now. I mean, I might as well just get some more processing. To be honest, I don't want to use all my trash because it does have other uses but they, it's quite easy to get more and the scrap is generally useful what have I got in the bin I hope to make a few hundred maybe from those hard to know really but um it's, I mean, it's early but we're out of stamina and rather than use consumables maybe I'll just go to bed have a quick look at the, the telly I'm just going to click through and see what Tippy's got. Yeah, so we've, so we've seen that one before. Weather forecast for tomorrow. Wet and rainy, nice. So no watering tomorrow. Maybe we'll do an ocean day or something. Oh, I, I don't know why I'm doing that. Detective. Mass Detective, Arc 1. Oh, no, I th Tony. I remember Tony. No, we've done that already, haven't we? Yeah, we've 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 seen that one already. Get to bed. Ooh, mining. So we got stone stuff now. 
quite nice. Stone gates and fences. Oh, that'd be better than the trash fence and stuff. I mean, probably more expensive in terms of resources to craft, but aesthetically it will look a lot nicer. Uh, stone as well is is not too hard to get hold of because there's always you can always go to the mines and do some there. Um, Max stamina, nice. Ooh, this is good too. Bug jerky. Uh... <laughs> okay. Foraging, yeah, a few... 500 there altogether, not bad. Not quite enough to get our sickle carved, but... Uh... Yeah. So, I'll t I think I got at least a one skill point there, so let's um, go and spend that. Catching. So I could lowers awareness of insects and ocean critters by 10%. I think that's worth it. Uh, better quality, only 5% though. Chance to catch double. Now I think I take the uh, lowering their awareness stuff, because uh, that's probably my biggest issue at the moment. There, I've got, oh, I've got nearly 50 scraps. I think I'll kind of leave that there for now, like that. Rainy day, rainy day. Um, no harvesting or anything needed. So I think... Might do a little bit of fishing and a little bit of ocean today. Because there might be rainy weather fish that are good to catch, not sure. It's looking like garbage. Great. Anything worse than going fishing and catching a lump of trash? I mean, I suppose it's in the game because trash is useful, and I think at a late game, it might be a bit hard to get hold of. Like, I think it regenerates a little bit in the ocean, but not a huge amount. So I guess being able to catch stuff fishing probably just means you've always got a route to, to get it, even late game. we go, what do we get? A zebrafish. We've already caught one of those, but I can't remember if I've donated it or just sold it. So we'll take it to the museum. Taking a little bit of time to... there we go. Another zebrafish. Okay, well. Let's move on. Uh, diving I can get to this way, can't I, I think? Oh, damn, I didn't see that in time. I think it was a praying mantis. We've already donated them anyway. Let's do a little ocean fish off here. Garbage. You can tell because it doesn't have the wavy lines at the top. And more garbage. Great. <laughs> uh, sigh. Okay, well, one thing I do want to do... I have a suspicion that an area may have opened up the other the other night in a cutscene at the end of the last episode. I I think it's going to be here. I think we saw these trees glowing. That's what I think. So I want to go check it out and see if anything's changed. Yeah, that's not changed. Oh, it's butterfly. Oh, and cherries. Hello. Oh, gotcha. 
Ah, we've caught him already. Cherries, very nice. Okay, well that's still closed, that side. Oh no, I didn't see that in time. Let's go around the other way. Because I think it... I think it was here. What if that means the hot springs opened up? Convinced it was there, so I guess not. Okay. I'm sure it was this. I'm probably wrong. If it was a snail, I could catch a snail, even if he's alert him, I think he can't really get away, so <laughs> Go back to the temple. Oh, a comp. Or an oak seed, as it's called here. What the rich folks got in their bins. Ooh, chucking out moral mushrooms, are they? So these things, they, we get involved with these at some point, I'm just not quite sure when. Oh, hello. Little wood. Now, I don't think I've donated him. I think I may have sold one. I don't think I've donated one. the lookout yeah let's go to the lookout the flies but I won't bother with those this is caution hatty hatty I've no idea what that is have we met you Wataru yeah, you're looking for farming advice. Never worked the land myself. I'm more at home at sea. Except for my plants here, my lovelies. Okay. Oh, we met Watery, so we hadn't met him before. Now he's got a little setup here at the lighthouse. Oh. Might do a little spot of fishing just off his uh, jetty here. We've got a fish this time. Got a lively one too. I get it. There we go. I crawl. Okay, cool. Uh, I might want to go and donate some stuff because uh, I filled up most of my slots already. I'm gonna bother with a fly. What I probably should have done, Coral Inn. I haven't been in there yet. Good idea to rent out sales space in the lobby. Uh, we've met Raj, I think. The coffee shop is closed when it's raining like this, so I usually spend the day volunteering at the shelter. 
And we've met that lady as well. I can't remember her name though. Okay, uh, yeah, okay, so what I think I'll do is I'll, I'm going to teleport back to the farm, first thing. Oh, I keep doing that, I keep fishing the blimmin' thing. Then I'm going to go to the museum, and then we'll go diving. So, I think we have, I've sold this, so I've, I think I have donated that. I can't remember if I've donated a snail. I don't think I've... I've definitely donate one of those. I'll do those two. For the trash in... Mind you, I'm going to be getting trash in the ocean anyway, so I don't need to worry too much about that. I think this is the quickest way to the museum. Because it's only up here. Yeah, I've done snails. Okay, so it's only this mackerel, actually. And we can sell the rest. I won't bother going back to the farm. Well, actually, I suppose I could go back to the farm, because it's got a teleport anyway, hasn't it? So that's probably... Some of those two. That's probably not a bad idea. I think it's a couple of days away to the next festival as well. I don't think it'll be in this episode though. I think that'll be the next one. Uh, boom, 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 boom. All right, let's teleport over to the diving area. I guess I should go to the shop and check the um, Notice board, Aaron's board, again at some point. Probably a good idea. Oh, hello. We've got another upside down jellyfish. No, it doesn't look like an upside down jellyfish. It looks different. Oh, no, it was. It was. I think I donated the last one. Oh, got a chest, very nice. Let's just carry on this area. I'm not exactly sure where the next lantern will be, but I don't want to get too far from the plinth that it plugs into. So what have we got over here? I think it's probably a good idea to clear out this near stuff first, just in case it's quite close. I'll tell you what, the people of this island are absolute litter bugs. Look at all this litter on the ocean. I mean, that's not down to pufferfish, is it? That's down to the people who live here. <laughs> I would think. Uh, oh, we've got another sea slug. Grab you. So I think I've previously cleared all this area. Like, this stuff is just uh, repopulating, I think. I'll grab the clam, though. Slug as well. Oh no, I'm harvesting it. I don't want to do that. So I'll grab that kelp as well. I'm not going to clear all this trash just because I, I think I've obviously already done this area so. I'm just looking for kind of the new stuff that um, might have a lantern under it. I'm guessing we'll find something in this area.
you look at the map. So I think I'm here. And I think these, I think this is closed off currently. I'm, I could be wrong. We'll head up there and have a look. Uh, but I think we're kind of, this is kind of the last corner of this area before something new opens up. There we go. I will eat, get some more stamina though. Interesting, so it hasn't opened up this area. Uh, okay. I'll tell you what, let's have a look up here. Because there should be another way through. Yeah, so this is blocked. So maybe I can get down here, though? Because I need to be pressing on into new areas. So I've, I've, I've done all the uh, altars here. Aha, here we go. This is all blocked off before. So if we go down... Yeah, so we're going into this area. I'm guessing we might be able to meet someone down here, potentially. What I'll do is I'll just um, sort of carve a route through to that area it might be a merfolk potentially or another diver oh hello sea urchin uh, yes yeah, so we need to we need to come around come around this bit oh, there's a crab there I wonder if I can crack catch that I bet I can Oh no, okay, what can we get rid of? Uh, a couple of stone. Pom pom crab. Uh, okay, okay, right, so yeah, it, so we'd have to go down here. It is currently blocked off though. Uh, so we would need to, I think we'd need to do these two altars and then probably move move down into that area. Bit of a goal, though. Anything else I can get rid of? Hmm. Kind of want to keep all that stuff. So we'll just leave that shell. Uh, but let's call down the anchor. I'm pretty tired. I think what I'll do is I'll head to the museum and we'll donate anything like the pom-pom crab and stuff that uh, they don't already have. Then we can go and sell stuff otherwise. I'd quite like to get you... Okay, no, there's stuff to get here, isn't it? I'm going to try and grab you because I don't think I've caught you before. Oh, you're too alert. Ah! ah. My nemesis. Might need a better net, potentially? Not sure. While we're in, while we're in town, we'll, we'll check the errand board as well, see if there's anything else to, to fulfill. So I'd kind of like to get a nice uh, scarecrow. Okay, oh, they don't want the black sea urchin, but they do want the pom-pom crab. So we'll donate him. 
There's a bunch of stuff to sell. We can see a crab. There's a sea slug. There's a starfish. A couple of jellyfish. I see the crab. Oh, what's that? fish swimming around. I quite like the rainy days, it's just, you know, you can just go out and get on with stuff. It is an errand. One carrot. For how many days? Seven days. Oh, we'll do that because I've got carrots growing. I don't really know why I've come in here because I'm saving money at the moment, so I don't really want to spend any. Um, yeah, I'll just come out. A look at the calendar as well. Mr. C Mr. Birthday Mark, I think that is. I don't know who this is. Um, I think he's the nasty guy who owns the vineyard. I think he was mean to me. And then we got the 21st. I'm not quite sure what that festival is, but we'll take part in it. It's five o'clock, it's my bedtime. <laughs> I'm exhausted. Hard day of fishing and ocean clearance. Doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. Hoping to get a decent amount of money though, because we're selling quite a lot of interesting stuff anyway, even if. Well, it may not be potentially very valuable stuff, but there's a decent amount of stuff there. Uh, yeah, we'll save the coffers until I'm sort of doing that. Well, I just said. Um, I'll probably stash the fertilizer in there now for now as well. Uh, I'm going to unpin the tasks just because they're kind of longer term stuff. Well, apart from the carrot one, but that's fine. I wonder how many we need to to sort of trigger the pick starter at the uh, museum. Hmm. Right, I think it's. I think it might be bedtime. Skill point, max stamina. Oh, we can re we can craft a recycling machine now, which is good. I mean, we we got one as a reward anyway from a bundle, but that's that's good to know. 600. We've got enough now for the uh, sickle, or scythe as the game calls it. I think of a scythe as like, you know, the bigger thing you hold with two hands, like the, like the Grim Reaper has, you know, famously, or is depicted as having. Um, we'll have a look at the menu. I think, I'm thinking I'm going to end the episode here. We'll have a quick look at the letter. Tomorrow the town will be looking for volunteers to attend the tree planting festival. If you'd like to volunteer, pay us a visit between 8 and 2. We meet in the forest right behind your farm. Oh, okay. We'll start the tree planting festival as soon as we gather enough volunteers. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that for sure. Okay. Uh, oh, the sugar cane's ready to harvest, but we'll do that uh, in the next episode. So I'll just say thanks very much for watching this one. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, it's just nice to be working towards stuff, I think. And uh, yeah, no, it feels like you're making a little bit of progress each time. And I think that's pretty cool. Um, obviously, it's a longer term game. It's not something you can rush through. I don't ex know exactly how many episodes I'll be doing, but I'm certainly enjoying it. And as long as I'm enjoying it, I'll be continuing with it. But hopefully you're enjoying it as well. And if you are, you know, leave me a comment. Let me know uh, what you think about the game. If you are enjoying it, if you'd like to see more. If, um, you know, if you did enjoy this, if you could hit the thumbs up button as well, that'd be amazing. And if you're watching this and haven't already subscribed to the channel, that'd be amazing if you could do that too. Help us grow. So thanks very much. And I hope to see you next time for more Coral Island. Bye for now.